Hi, I'm Dr. Bill Crofts from the University of Warwick satellite team. Would you think that a satellite in space can help animals on Earth? We are building and launching a satellite that will help us to find out more about animals and birds on Earth so that we can protect them better. This satellite is called WUSAT3 and in this video we will tell you how it works. We've all seen wildlife programs where conservationists are walking around with aerials trying to track animals that are carrying radio tags. Wouldn't it be easier if we could track these animals from space where we could cover all of the Earth's surface and track them wherever they are? There are satellites that do wildlife tracking, but the problem is that the tags need to be large and heavy, so only some animals can be monitored in this way. WUSAT3 is going to test a different method of detecting the radio tags and this will allow the tags to be smaller and lighter. If WUSAT3 can locate a signal from a tag more like this size then that would be a big help to wildlife conservationists and there would be a lot more animals and birds that could be tagged and monitored from space so that we can learn more about them. This slide shows how monitoring from space could allow the tracking of large numbers of birds or animals at the same time. Hi, I'm Sarah Collette and I'm an electrical engineer on the WUSAT-3 team. Our WUSAT-3 satellite will be launched to the International Space Station. The astronauts on the International Space Station will then put WUSAT-3 into Earth orbit. When WUSAT-3 detects a tag signal, it takes a picture of the Earth below and works out where the signal is in the image. From this, we can work out the location of the bird on the Earth. We can report this information to the people tracking the bird's movement. Our WUSAT-3 wildlife tracking system would help to produce much smaller, lighter tags, and this would allow a greater number of species to be tracked. This would help to preserve wildlife if we can understand what happens to them as they move around our planet. I hope you found our project interesting. Thanks for listening.